My name is Jonathan Davis. I fight at Four Arms Fight Club. I've been training for going up to three and a half years now. Started in August, so it's been about three and a half years. I, I started boxing at uh, Savannah Gym down in um, down in uh, Southwest for a little bit, and uh, I met my friend Chris here. His dad ends up going to the gym. We go to school together, and he ended up telling me about the place. I thought, I thought I'd try it out. Yeah, I was I wasn't good at knowing sports, so, so yeah. I thought I'd try it out. I've actually fought Muay Thai fights, Jiu Jitsu tournaments, a lot of wrestling matches, boxing matches. This is my first amateur debut. I just turned 17, so I'm really excited. There was a couple of the difficulties because I can't dip my head. A lot of change in strategies and skill-wise. It was, it was completely different. I learned a lot of new stuff. Just coming to the gym completely changed me from boxing over to kickboxing, Muay Thai, wrestling, Jiu Jitsu. I learned it all and I loved it. My comfortable zone is stand-up. I've been, I'm just, I love the strike. I love to go in there and throw down, bang if I have to. And I just, I just love the strike. I'm comfortable on the ground. I love to wrestle. I've been wrestling for a while now, but striking is where it's at for me. I love it. First time I went into a ring, I was, I was, I was so nervous. I saw my mom there, my girlfriend. I was like, man, it's a lot of people. And it wasn't even a big fight. It was just a little family fun day here at Four Ounce. I was like, man, there's a lot of people here. You know, I fought some kid I didn't even know. It was it was the most scariest thing I've ever had to do in my life. You know, but I just I went in there, I got I got beat up, you know, for the first time ever fighting. You know, it was hard. It was hard to take it, but I ended up coming back, you know, because I just loved I just love the sport, I just love the fight, you know. So that's just first time got beat up, took a beating, but you know, time to come back. Didn't think it happened in the ring. I went in there cocky, thinking I'm good, I'm the best. I got to put it on me, you know, now I just got to stay calm, keep my head on straight. My nerves are going to be there, for sure, you're always going to have nerves. And I just got to trust my training, trust my coaches, everything will be fine. I got a lot of family there, they support me, so that's all I need. My opponent is uh, Sinjin Korean, very experienced guy, tough, tough person I know. And uh, I had another opponent he pulled, don't know why, but um, Sinjin Korea, he's a tough guy, I heard he's really experienced, fought one of my teammates. so. Should be, should be a fun fight. I'm not, I'm not scared. I'm just ready to throw down. I've been waiting for a long time. I, I think he'll try to take me down, you know, set up that shot. I heard he has a good shot, so throw that overhand. But I, I, I feel like I can keep the fight standing and where I want it, so I feel like I'll keep it standing and just go where I need to. I um, just want to thank all my teammates, uh, coaches, Alex Back, Bob Perez, Joseph McCamish, you know, my teammates, Jordan, Jordan Carmoda, Chris Elise, Alden Korea. I just can't thank them more enough. You know, my parents, my dad, of course, can't thank my dad enough. He's been there from the start, supporting me, my mom, my brother. Just couldn't ask for anything better. I'm so blessed. So.